How's it going, gents? What a crazy, crazy weekend, right? Crazy, crazy bonkers weekend. First thing we're going to draw attention to is S R N, not N at <laughs> not S N R, S R N. I was referring to it as S N R in the entirety of the last video. S R N, bonkers, bonkers, bonkers. This is, you know, absolute prime example of a pump and dump. We've had if, if a couple of days of riding this madness. We've all made our money off this. And I'm rather gutted because I, I missed my short, or rather, I just didn't take the short up here. It hit this trend line here uh, last night when we were all looking at it in the Discord together. And I was saying to the guys, you know, this is the area for the short, man. This is this is the time, you know. We, we were like, the chart was kind of like this. You know, it kind of had this where it was testing it. I was like, this is this is the area for the short. It's screaming out for a short. And I was actually playing uh, V Rising at the time uh, last night. And so my full attention wasn't on the charts. And I thought, ah, you know, I'm kind of in the middle of the game. I should, I should have closed the game out and gone over and, and properly focused on this. It's my own fault, really. I'm an idiot. Uh, I didn't take the short and missed out on this entire drop i just i just it was screaming out for it screaming out for a short fortunately though fortunately some of the guys in the discord did and they posted their profits <clears throat> so ben <clears throat> srn short 53 percent nice with 2x leverage 2x leverage 53 percent fantastic uh srn short again 2x leverage 12 percent um pack <laughs> srn short so he got the short yesterday 3x leverage 112 percent um who else we got uh short by emma 135 percent with 10x leverage crazy weekend and then we're going back into my srn long etc etc all the rest of the profits but yeah crazy weekend guys Keeping an eye on right now, uh, CEL and people. I feel like if people gets up into this area and starts bringing some of these horizontals, a retest for a long will be nice. I'm actually looking for a short somewhere up here, but we'll have to obviously wait and see and call it in the moment. But I really wanted to draw your attention to SRN. This is the prime example of a pump and dump, and these charts come and go all the time. Um something else i want to draw your attention to here guys is the 12 month percentage change cpi right so as we can see inflation is 8.6 percent and it's still here you know like we've got rising interest rates so you'd actually expect with the interest rate hike to see the inflation coming down but it's not you know we <clears throat> we're still up here at these peak levels of inflation but it's not it's it's not pushing the prices of assets and goods and services up for example like we're seeing the markets crash essentially aren't we even though we have peak inflation numbers and the reason for that is because of the rate hikes the rate hikes are something you need to take note of and really watch over the coming months and the coming the you know the duration of this year into next year <clears throat> is really taking note of these rate hikes and how they impact the market because as the rate hikes keep increasing and increasing and increasing, even with peak inflation, even even with inflation potentially going to increase into the you know the end of the year into next year, asset prices are going to fall. You know, it's going to hit. It's going to you're going to feel it when you go and you you're a consumer in everyday life. You know, you're going to feel it there. You're going to see the the increase in prices, but in the markets with asset prices we're not seeing we're not seeing the increase yet and it's because of the rate hikes so every time they do a rate hike guys it suppresses it suppresses the uh the inflation on the markets and the inflation cannot really take effect on the markets and push asset prices up so i'm expecting more downside i'm expecting more stagflation in the markets more dumps the pumps will be less pumpy and the dumps will be more dumpy. Um, and an example of this, you know, if we go back and we look at August 2017 to December 2018, which is this box. So this area here is 
August 2017, the start of the box here, all the way through to December 2018 into 2019. And we had the same thing that's kind of happening right now, you know, you see we have the interest rate hike through this period. So from August to September, uh, the December, sorry, increase, 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 increase. And as you can see, asset prices plummeted, assets prices plummeted as we had this increase. And we got the same thing that's going on here, you know, like we had this increase and we're increasing right now. This is an old chart. We're at 41,000 here. We're way down here now in the 18,000s. We're, we're decreasing, you know. And we had months and months and months of this. And we've only just, we've only just started these, uh, these rate hikes. So we've got a lot, lot, lot more of this sideways, of this bear market, of this, you know, downward spiral, if you will. So take note of that. Be cautious if you're looking to long here. This is going to be the best opportunity that potentially you're going to have in your lifetime with this coming recession, with asset prices being pushed down as far as they are and being able to pick up things like Ethereum, you know, potentially down at these prices of $300. Could you imagine? That's like a 90% move from the top down to $300-ish. Imagine picking up Ethereum at $300, you know, and then holding it into the next bull run. Could you imagine? Well, potentially that's, that's going to be a reality, right? Something to watch out for. So that's that's really it, guys. Just a quick market update for the weekend. SRN. These plays will happen, even in this bear market. Something like this will happen again. And you've got to be prepared for it. It's the same chart patterns. It's the same chart patterns that come and pop their head up every time. And we're just replaying. It's rinse and repeat. Rinse and repeat. Rinse and repeat. We're playing the same patterns all the time. And if you want a community of like-minded people that can teach you, or if you just want a community where you can come and chill and we can just look at the charts together, uh, play games together, etc., etc., come and join the Discord, right? Catch you in the next one, guys.